Don Lewis, who vanished without a trace in 1997. Carol Baskin has always insisted she had nothing to do with her husband's disappearance and has never been named a suspect. Don Lewis was born April 30, 1938, and was a native of Dade City, Florida. By 1981, Lewis had made his living through trucking, real estate, and his used car businesses. He was married to his first wife, Gladys Lewis Cross, and had three daughters and an adopted son. In January 1981, Lewis met Carol Murdoch on Nebraska Avenue in Tampa on a night when she fled her house after being attacked by her abusive first husband, Michael Murdoch. Carol Murdoch and Lewis began having an affair while both were still married. She became one of his many girlfriends and substantially grew his wealth by helping him buy and sell real estate in 1984. Lewis and Murdoch divorced each of their spouses and married in 1991. The following year, the couple co-founded Wildlife on Easy Street, now called Big Cat Rescue, an animal sanctuary for big cats in Tampa. The two clashed over how to run the sanctuary. He wanted to breed the cats and operate it as a business, while she wanted it to be a non-profit charity. In early 1997, Lewis began transferring ownership of his properties in Florida to a Costa Rican company he controlled. In the days leading up to his disappearance, he had bought a plane ticket to Costa Rica and was loading equipment onto a truck he planned to drive to Miami. In July 1997, Lewis filed a request for a restraining order against his wife claiming she had threatened to kill him and had hidden his gun to prevent him from protecting himself. This request was rejected. Baskin claims that he filed the restraining order because she would haul away some of his junk property whenever he visited Costa Rica. Lewis continued to live with his wife afterwards despite having sought the restraining order. Lewis had told his wife multiple times that he wanted a divorce, but she has said she thought he was not serious about it. Lewis disappeared on August 18, 1997, after leaving his home to make an early morning delivery around 6 a.m. On August 20th, his white 1989 Dodge Ram van was found at the Pilot Country Airport in Spring Hill, Florida, 40 miles away from the sanctuary. At the time of his disappearance, Lewis owned several planes and was known to sometimes fly even though his private pilot license was suspended. The keys to the van were found on the floorboard and the van had been parked for a couple of days. No evidence was found within the van. The Hillsborough County Sheriff's Office found no sign of foul play at the Tampa Sanctuary and visited the Costa Rican town of Bajasis, where Lois owned a 200-acre park as part of their investigation. The investigation in Costa Rica lasted five days. In Costa Rica, investigators found indications that Lewis engaged in extramarital affairs and questionable business practices. They also found that two of Lewis's ocelots had recently been shipped out, but their whereabouts were unknown. None of Lewis's credit cards have been used since his disappearance. In 2020, using the popularity of the Netflix documentary series Tiger King, Hillsborough County Sheriff Chad Cronister appealed to the public for legitimate leads or evidence for the case. Since the release of the series, the Hillsborough County Sheriff's Office has received six tips a day related to Lewis's disappearance. Cronister expressed his belief that a former employee of Wildlife on Easy Street that had a sour relationship with either Lewis or Baskin will step forward with evidence. Cronister reiterated that his department does not have any type of evidence, not one piece, that suggests that Lewis was killed or that a crime was even committed. 
He also stated his opinion that Tiger King was spun for entertainment. The case is still open as of 2021. Now let's ask Don questions about what really happened and see if he will communicate through the spirit box. Hi, welcome back. I'm getting ready to do a spirit box session in the case of Don Lewis. He went missing in 1997. He hasn't been seen or heard of since. So I've got the ghost box set up with the spirit box and it's an FM scanner. It kind of picks up radio frequencies and then you can put it on a faster setting so it'll scan faster and then spirits are able to kind of come through the radio waves and then you hear the words coming through and then this is kind of an amplifier so it amplifies the words that come through the spirit box and then i also have the ghost tube sls app set up so any words that come through the pick it up like a dictionary and then spirit can come through and talk to me that way and then I also have the Buddy Boo Bear set up and he hasn't really lit up too much so I was thinking it's probably because there's not too much spirit that's been coming around him so maybe that's a good thing. And then I have Don Lewis's picture set up with one of his tigers, it looks like a leopard. And then I have the candles set up, I have the incense burning, I have some crystals laid out. It just kind of helps with the energy coming through. So let's get started and see if we can get Don to talk to us through the spirit box. So I'm here to talk to Don Lewis. Will you come through please and say your name for us? You can talk to this device. <laughs> So Don, will you come through and say your name one more time for us, just for confirmation that we know it's you? I thought I heard a man say, I'm here. I heard justice. So Don, will you can you come through and tell us the last thing you remember that happened to you? I thought I heard it. I don't know. Don, you've been missing since 1997. Can you tell us what happened to you? I thought I heard a man say, don't shoot. He said, don't shoot.
What relationship are you referring to? No. to Costa Rica, you bought a lot of real estate? So you were pretty wealthy from all the real estate you bought? I thought I heard VIP. Did you make him to Costa Rica? The last time you were seen, you were leaving to go to Costa Rica. Did you make it? I murdered. Who murdered you? Were you murdered in the United States? Who murdered you? People that think Carol Baskins did something to you, did she? <laughs> so you had restraining orders against Carol? Guilty. Did she hurt you or do something to you? Jealousy. Was Carol jealous of your girlfriends in Costa Rica? So I heard that you sent two ocelots ahead of you and they were never found. No one knows where they went. What happened to them? So the ghost tube app came on and said, Pamela? Who's Pamela? Is that a girlfriend? Did you have a girlfriend 
She murdered you, and um, Joe Exotic, he made a big deal about murdering her and thinking that she murdered you, and he's actually in prison for that. Did you know that? This was a contact. Who said that? Don Lewis, can you give the name of the person that did something to you? She did it. Is it Carol? Yes. Carol feed you to the tigers. What's the last thing you remember? Do you, is it okay that I'm talking to you, Don? I think I heard it's okay. Don, can you name a person that did something to you? something to confirm that you're on the spirit side, you can ring this bell, you can make this flame brighter, can you do something to show us you're here, you can light up this little bear, his paws will light up, do something to show us that you're here. I mean, Joe Exotic's in prison for 22 years for acting like he's going to kill Carol. I don't know if he was joking or serious, but did you know that? I heard that Joe Exotic has cancer. Can you tell me what type of cancer he was diagnosed with? People that speculate that you went to Costa Rica and changed your identity and you're living off the money. Is that true? I heard my name, Amanda.
God, can you give us any clues as to what happened to you? You can talk through this device also and it'll pick up words. So I put my hand on this coil because it adds my energy to it. I believe. So Don, can you give us the name of who's responsible for your disappearance? I hear a real low, soft, like, man's voice coming through. Can you even speculate that your plane crashed? I'm going to switch over to the necrophonic in a few minutes. Don, can you give us any clues in your case? Did you disappear on purpose? I think I heard murder. Who murdered you? Was it the tiger lady? She knew you had a girlfriend in Costa Rica. She must have been mad about that. I thought I heard enough. I said it. Where's your body? Did she put you through a meat grinder? It sounded like it took me on a plane. Did Carol do something to you because you were going to divorce her? I bet I heard a shooting. Headphones are definitely recommended with the spare box session. You can hear the EVPs a lot clearer. Carol has not been named a person of interest. <laughs> it sounded like something like closest insurance. Did she do something to you so she could keep the, the tiger face? Oh yeah. So she didn't want to get a divorce? No. Nope. Do you know that she gave all your guns away? 
and one of them is missing. Where's the missing gun? She buried it. It was it buried on the property? Don, where's your body? She didn't want to leave that tiger park. Okay, I'm going to do the Necrophonic app for a few minutes. We'll see what comes through that. Yay. So Don, can you come through this and talk to us tonight? Can you say the name of the person that did something to you? It sounded like here. Uh, like here. Really quiet. Uh, Dead. Who killed you, Don? Did you make one of the girlfriend's families mad because you were dating the young girls? Did they do something to you? Did you run away with one of your Costa Rican girlfriends? They want me. Does anyone want to talk tonight? 
We just want to talk to Don Lewis. Is he here? I heard no. Is it okay if we talk to you, Don? We have your picture set up. Who's in the picture with you? Who's in the picture? What's his name or her name? It almost sounded like Dolly. Is that a tiger? Where are you now, Don? Don Lewis, where are you? Are you crossed over on the other side? Dead. How did you die? Were you murdered? Are you hiding? Are you in Costa Rica? Who's Pamela? Can you name, say the name of whoever did something to you? Can you tell me how you died? How did Don Lewis die? Thank you for talking to me. Will there ever be justice in your case, Don? Thank you for talking to me. Good night. Bye. Thank you. Yeah. <laughs> I heard goodbye. That concludes the spirit box session in the case of Don Lewis. Hopefully justice will be served in his case and there'll be some kind of closure for everybody so we at least know the truth of what really happened to him. So thank you for watching. And there's some links below. There's going to be the Patreon membership where you can sign up now and become a Patreon member. And there's also a link to the regular member channel for on the YouTube channel where you can join and become a member of the family that way. And they both have different little perks on them. So each of them can be fun. So thank you so much for joining and watching the channel. And if you haven't already, remember to subscribe, hit the notification button. It's like at the top of the channel in the corner. 
and then you'll get notifications of when my new videos come out.